savour the sweetness of the jubilee. We pray, Almighty God, may our lost glories and properties be restored back to our land. As we continue to savour the sweetness of the jubilee, we pray, may love and forgiveness flourish again in our land. We pray that reconciliation and peace will thrive against hate and war in river states. We pray, even as we continue to savour the sweetness of, of, of the jubilee, that our land once again will yield its fruits. It will not just yield its fruits in plenty, O oh Lord. We pray that every one of us will eat of the fruits of the land so that our fathers and mothers, our families will enjoy the beauties of our states and our teeming youth will find abundance of job. Mighty God, today, turn our captivities into freedom Amen. and blessings and show us your compassion again. We are trusting in you that your blessings will ever fill our life as the waters cover the sea. More than anything else, we pray, may your love, may your presence be felt all over River State. For we have committed our cause to you. We make these prayers through Christ our Lord. Amen. So, dear Heavenly Father, when you called Nehemiah, you gave him a band of men and women to enable him to build the walls of Jerusalem in 52 days. When you called David, you gave him a band of men to enable him to serve God in his generation. Dear Lord Jesus Christ, when you came to save us, you also called a band of men as disciples and apostles to enable you to do your work. Here in our state, when you gave us the Golden Jubilee Governor, you gave him a band of men as commissioners, special advisors, senior special assistants. You gave him local government chairmen. You gave him all manner of men to enable him fulfill the promises that he made to the peoples of River State in his campaign. And today here he is fulfilling another promise that he made to the people that when he becomes a governor, he will build an ecumenical center. Lord, he has many more things in his heart he wants to do. Therefore, I now commit Governor Yeson Wike, all the ministries, departments, agencies in River State into the hand of the Most High God for the fulfillment of all other promises they have made to your glory and honor in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. We're praying for the past governors and leaders of River State. Father, in the name of Jesus, we pray for everyone that's ever ruled River State. It says you don't labor in vain, nor bring forth for trouble. Therefore, we declare every one of them that have ever led this state in the past. In the name of Jesus Christ, they shall eat the fruit of their labor. Amen. They will never die in the midst of their days. We shall keep them strong and healthy to enjoy everything they have lived upon River State. Amen. And we declare them blessed and remain fruitful all the days of their lives. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. We're praying for the progress and development of River State. Our Lord and our God, in the past two years, we have seen projects and things that touch the lives of the ordinary person in River State and every determination to continue to do things that will affect the lives of the people you will give to the governor and all who are around him in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Lord, where there are places that bad report is making for development not to come in as it ought to, open the door by yourself in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Let businesses thrive in this place and let the state continue to move on more and more and development in every part of the state. We thank you. Because we know you are God that answers prayers. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 
my pleasure, and I'm happy to do so, to invite His Excellency and his family to please come to the front of the altar and be specifically prayed for by Pastor Adeboe. May I ask you to please kneel down. And could you all please stretch your hands towards this family and just wish them whatever you wish yourself. If we want it to be well with you, wish that it will be well with them. If we want to live long, wish that they will live long. If we want to prosper, wish that they will prosper. Whatever you wish yourself, wish them now. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Our Father and our God, you said if two of us shall agree as touching anything we ask on earth, it will be done for us by our Father in heaven. All of us who are here together are in agreement at this moment. And I'm only speaking on their behalf. And I know you will grant this request. So, Father, accept our thanks in Jesus' name. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, this family that is kneeling down at the altar now, we never know sorrow. Yeah. There will be no sickness. Yeah. There will be no death. Yeah. The Almighty God will build a wall of fire around about this family. Yeah. The arrows of the enemy will never be able to penetrate. Yeah. This family has started well. They will finish well. God will keep on supporting you. He will keep on promoting you. Even as we are beginning another 50 years, this family will begin to enjoy a brand new beginning of joy, a new beginning of success, a new beginning of glory. It shall be well with this family, and they will never know failure. And so shall it be. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. God bless you. Thank you. A round of applause for Jesus. A bigger, bigger round of applause for Jesus. Can I hear an amen? Please be seated. And now we, we will take the special Golden Jubilee Thanksgiving offering. Let the collection bags be taken around, and then the Government House Choir Band will lead us in some songs as we Hallelujah. very quickly take the Golden Jubilee Thanksgiving offering. Why take it, I'm not. Oh, really, man. 